Hi, my name is Eric Burleson, and I agree we all want America to be great again. But to make America great again, we must understand how we got there to begin with. The truth is that America's greatness didn't come from one elected leader or even government itself. But America's greatness comes when the citizens are free to practice self-governance. That means that they're doing their part, living good lives and doing what is right, both publicly and privately. That requires an internal moral compass to guide them and hold them accountable, even when doing so is not convenient or when no one's looking. If America is losing her greatness, it's because more and more Americans are rejecting self-governance by ignoring the moral principles that made our nation great and are demanding instead a government that rules over them. So what do we do? Like Benjamin Franklin said, I believe in one God, creator of the universe, that he governs it by his providence, that he ought to be worshiped, and that the most acceptable service that we can render to him is doing good to his other children. That means that we are to treat our neighbors with love and respect and not try to regulate their lives for them. Franklin went on to say that our souls are immortal and that we will be judged later for our actions today. While clearly not all Americans had the same beliefs then, nor do all Americans have the same beliefs today, what binds us are our commonly shared values. Among them is that every person has an individual right from our creator, such as life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. And you know, the pursuit of happiness isn't the right to be happy, but it gives us the right to pursue those things in life which makes our lives meaningful, like providing for ourselves and our families in the jobs or careers of our own choosing, and having the freedom to live according to our beliefs while we respect the beliefs of others. But at the end of the day, it is our common understanding that no earthly government can make us great again. No law will ultimately compel a lawless person to live a moral life. So it comes down to the fact that if we are to be a great nation, we the people must be able to govern ourselves through a moral understanding of who we are, why we are here, and give every person the dignity and respect that they are due. That is what will make America great again. As Alexis de Tocqueville said, America is great because she is good. And if America ever ceases to be good, she will cease to be great. For more information, please go to my website at ericburleson.net. That's ericburleson.net. Thank you.